<sighs> a nice crisp lager. Or is it? Today we will talk about what crisp actually means and if it even can be defined. Beer discussion. I think most people would agree this is a crisp lager, but if you were to describe the flavors to a person that doesn't drink beer regularly, what would you say crisp really means? As you might know, I'm really interested in aromas and flavors in beer, and I always want to learn more. So when someone just describes a beer as hoppy, it kind of itches around my body. What kind of hops and in what way, you know? And if someone calls a beer fruity, I want to know which fruit. This beer, for instance, the Pilsner Urquell, to me is pretty fruity. I always find some sort of wild uh, strawberries in here. But it's a Czech-styled, very bitter Pilsner, so no one else would call it fruity, right? And you have the German wheat beers, where you can find uh, banana. And of course the New England IPAs, where you get all sorts of uh, tropical fruits. So when someone calls a beer crisp, I always wonder, what do that person actually mean? I think we can agree that a crisp beer needs to be light-bodied and uh, dry. And that's typical for the North German Pilsner style, like uh, the Jiva. This one is also pretty bitter, but we will get back to that. The other day I had another Pilsner that was actually even drier than the Jiva. So I had that beer first, and then when I had the Jiva afterwards, it actually felt kind of zesty and uh, maybe not sweet, but more fruity. <laughs> So does that mean that the other Pilsner was more crisp? A bit of a funny story. I actually sent in this uh, kind of question to my favorite beer podcast. They have uh, one beer brewer and one beer journalist and uh, beer judge. So I thought this could be an interesting discussion. So I asked about this word, crisp. It's called krispig in Swedish. It's, uh, I think it's the same thing. And then also another word that doesn't m make the same sense in English. But the question didn't really contribute to an interesting discussion. It was almost like, the words are fine, just drop it. <laughs> and I realized one of the persons actually sometimes use one of the words. So I hope no one got offended. And I know sometimes when I get really passionate about the topic, people can get slightly annoyed because I don't stop asking questions. I want to know more and more and dissect and I'm not satisfied with the answers. But there is also a third person in this podcast who is maybe a bit more like me, not as, you know, professional and uh, knowledgeable and sometimes ask kind of the same questions as me, and he tried to get the specific answer to what crisp really means, and the summary was dry and bitter. And that makes sense, right? The jiva is light, dry, and bitter. It has all the crisp characteristics. But then, funnily enough, just the other day, I saw a video from Peter, the master of Hoppets. He's one of my favorite beer reviewers because he really gets into the nitty gritty of the flavors. And in the video I watched, he tried some sort of macro lager and combined it with uh, Asian food. And that beer had low bitterness, but he still called it crisp. Huh? But my thoughts go like this. I actually need to check if it's uh, the same in English. Yeah, crisp weather. It's cold outside, it's refreshing, and it's almost, you know, biting your chins a little bit. And you can get the similar experience 
biting into a um, sour apple or maybe a lemon, why not? So maybe a beer isn't really bitter, but it kind of wakes you up in the same way. I would love to know your thoughts. What does crisp mean to you? And what is the most crisp beer you know? Thank you for watching and uh, remember, drink crisp on